everybody, my name is Sarah and welcome back to my living room for this week's midweek mini frugal living vlog. If you are a brand new viewer, I hope I earn your subscription. It means a lot to me when you subscribe. And if you are a returning subscriber, welcome back and thank you for your continued support. Well, let's kick off this video with a thrift store haul. And please stick around so I can show you some of the meals and projects I'm working on this week. I think I need to add some fresh water to this. We got some good stuff at the thrift store this week. This is a little miniature thrift store haul, but it has some goodies. Right here, we've got a two pack of pillow shams and this was $8, 75% off. So it was $2. That's $1 for each pillow sham. Let's open this up. I've never heard of this brand. It's called Cuddle Down. Oh, I love this golden color. That's beautiful. Look at the texture on that. Really nice. And tell somebody washed these before they donated it. It smells good. Moving on, this was a wonderful find. These are dissolvable labels for canning. It was full price at $1, and this is what it looks like. So I thought that was really neat. I've never seen these in person, so that should be fun to use in the kitchen. I don't know what these usually sell for, but it seemed like a dollar for 60 labels was a great deal. If you've ever used these and you know what the price is, please let me know. Well, I'm happy with my little miniature thrift store haul. I'm going to go ahead and wash these so I can start using them right away. Something Ranch Chopped Salad Kit. I hope it's still good. We'll find out. Smells fine. Let's pick through this salad. Do you ever get a song stuck in your head? I've got that... Uh, they tried to make me go to rehab. I said, no, no, no. That's been stuck in my head all day. That looks good. And this is what we're getting rid of. Let's get all this added. These are like little fritos. A little cheese. Gave that a good stir. Let's try the dressing. Added just a little more. I think I added more than half of the dressing this time. Let's add some guacamole. It's added. I really like this canned chicken. I've got to get some more black pepper. Let's pepper this down. Pepper, pepper, pepper. Oh, this is beautiful. Look at this salad kit all doctored up with a can of chicken and some guacamole and the beautiful black pepper. I'm going to enjoy this. Yum. I added just a little more dressing. Let's give this a try. This is really good. The salad kit with the canned chicken. Thank you, Food Pantry. I'm taking down my Winter Wonderland Christmas tree. These look like the only empty ornament boxes I've got. Did you put up a Valentine's Day tree? I've heard from some of you that you did, and that sounds like a really good idea. I think this little clear plastic box is for the clear plastic icicles, so let's take those off. Get this all tucked away for the next Christmas. I was gonna say next year, but it's this year. <laughs> Now I've got these up and up quart slider storage bags and we're just going to take one of these out and we're going to put the plastic white ice sickles in here because they already have the hook. Oh, whoops, I lost a hook. They already have the hooks on them and so we're just going to drop these in the bag. I'm just re-hooking this and closing the hook up a little bit. I can nail that one is all done. I love these little wooden ornaments. Couldn't believe I found these at the thrift store. Love these ornaments. Oh, 
Oh, I missed one. Let me grab that. All we have left are the lights. I can't believe I got the tree in the box. I can actually close the box. Yay! Well, we're at the river today. All the snow has melted. This hill might not look like much, but it's a bear. I've been using this coconut milk in my coffee, and it's okay, but I really need to get some half and half. I didn't want to go out tonight, but we're going to have to go to the store. I'm not going to believe this, but it's 62 degrees outside, but let's go to Food Lion. Let's go shopping. Well, let's get in this store and get what we need tonight. It's coffee time. Yum. Oh, I love these curtains. I'm so glad to have a good thrift store. Thank you everyone that responded to the community question I put out there about the type of videos that you want to see. I, I am making a few different style videos for you right now. And I'm going to try to do the kitchen tour before the living room tour because some of you have been asking for that kitchen tour for quite some time. Here's a little plant update for you. I got this cleared off from, this is where I moved the Winter Wonderland Christmas tree over here. But now that we've got that put away, I've got some of the smaller plants on here. I think this looks really cute. This is the poinsettia. It started doing good on this side, but now it's dying back again. But I'm still trying. And this one here, we've got some new growth. That's exciting. I think this looks really cute. I like all of the terracotta colors against the green and then the dark soil. I think that's really beautiful. I've got to do something about all of these coats. So far, so good. I've got my scarves folded up, the chair I can sit in it, and I've got my heavy coat hanging on the hook. These hooks are only good for one pound. I'm pretty sure the coat's heavier than a pound, but so far it hasn't fallen off the wall, so hopefully it'll work. Looking good, or at least better. Time to make up the bed. All done. Looking good. Gonna doctor this up with some collagen. One of our subscribers, I think it was Judy, hi Judy, had asked about what collagen tastes like. And when you get plain unflavored collagen, you can add it to your drinks or like I did to the oatmeal and you're not gonna taste it. Remember from the food pantry haul, the cranberry currant and walnut topping? Let's add this over here. I already gave this a taste, it's wonderful. Although you can't really see the topping mixed into the oatmeal, it's in there and it's tasty. So this is how you can take a simple oatmeal packet and doctor it up with what you get at the food pantry. Show you what I ordered from Amazon. I got this on sale and this is peel and stick wallpaper and I liked the geometric design and you see how the gold color 
coordinates well with the gold color in the rug. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this, but I thought it was such a good sales price. I went ahead and got it to try to run an experiment. And since it's peel and stick, it's not permanent. So I figured I could do something fun with this. I have an idea for the bathroom sink. I bought this from a thrift store probably five years ago. I think it was designed to hold CDs. I think this can work in here. All right, let's move this stuff over here. Do, do, do. Cleaning. Rearranging. That looks pretty good. see if this fits. That looks really good. It helps corral the clutter in the bathroom. If you're wondering where my bathroom mirror is, I don't have one above the sink. I've got this little mirror right here and that's what I use in the bathroom. I'm unwrapping this roll of toilet paper, but I'm gonna get some usage out of that outer wrapping first. But what I'm gonna do with this is sometimes if I run out of paper towels, I can use this outer wrapping of the toilet paper container and I'll just wipe off the counter. I know that might look a little funny or seem a little odd, but it actually works. So sometimes you can just use things in an unusual, unique way. Don't be scared to think outside of the box, or in this case, the toilet paper roll. Remember this? Let's give these cumin and chipotle pinto beans a try. I put about half of the packaging in here. You can really smell the spice once this heated up. Canned chicken. Just heated this up in the microwave. Little pepper. Pepper, pepper, pepper. This Garden of Eden blue chips. No salt added. Now even tastier. I got this from Food Lion. Although the Best Buy date has passed, let's give it a try. <laughs> Smells good, looks good. Let's add this guacamole. And this is my beautiful food pantry meal. We've got the beans, salsa, guacamole, chicken, chips. Well, it's a combination of things that I bought, but most of it came from the food pantry. I'm very grateful to the food pantry. I get to eat better because of them. Let's dig in. Okay, that's really good. And the chips not having any salt on them, it's totally fine. There's so much salt in the beans and the salsa that it doesn't taste funny. It tastes just fine. Not too salty. Do you guys remember this? Let's balance our chakras. Chakra Balancing Empowering Solar Plexus. All right. Oh, look, it's got a little roller ball on it. I'm just gonna put this right here. Smells pretty good. All right, check. The chakras are balanced. Thank you for making it to the end of my video. I appreciate all of the new viewers that decided to hit that subscribe button. And to all of my returning subscribers, thank you for all of your continued support. And tonight's beverage of the evening is chamomile tea. Did you have a favorite part to tonight's video? If you did, please let me know what it was in the comments. I had a couple of meals in there. I hope you enjoyed that. And also, do you have any ideas for what to do with that peel and stick wallpaper? The ideas I have don't have anything to do with my walls, but we'll see how that goes. 
And what about those balancing the chakras? I've never had essential oils for that. I don't really know much about it, but that seemed kind of fun. Well, the next video comes out on Tuesday, and that's going to be a food pantry haul video. I hope you can make it, and thanks again for sticking with me to the end and watching my video. I appreciate all of you for being here. We'll talk to you soon. Have a great weekend. Bye-bye.